Here's Paper Mario, the Origami King, but Ollie and Olivia have been swapped. I hope that you enjoy this video. Do you think there are any toads around here, Mario? Maybe we can go turn them into paper. She can't see me like this. Why do you dislike toads? Mario, why don't you want to live in a world where everyone is a toad? We can find more toads! Patience, Princess. This will work out just fine. So, you're Mario, Princess Peach's hero, right? All you need is a bit of convincing. Imagine a world where everyone is a toad. Isn't that great? Plain toads suck! So, what do you say? Will you join us in creating a world full of toads? Or will we have to get crumply? Join us! Yes or no? I thought you'd want to help me, Mario. Take a good long look at Princess Peach. We'll turn her into a toad. That sounds better, don't you think? No need to answer. You'll soon feel the power of toads for yourself. Folded Soldier, come forth! These soldiers want to turn the world into toads! What are we going to do, Mario? I want the world to be... Toads! Embrace the toad! Nice hammer attack, Mario! We can take out these folded soldiers with your hammer, and we can stop the world from being overrun with nameless toads! You might have stopped that Goomba, but you'll never stop my army of folded soldiers from creating a toad world. I suppose it's time to show my true form. Sister! I just want to stop these toads. No! It can't be! I didn't want to believe it could be you. How many times did I tell you there were too many toads? We'll stop you, Olivia! Why couldn't Mario have just saved me and gone on an adventure where he rescues toads? Brother, I'm going to fill this world with toads, and you won't be able to tell them apart. Oh, and by the way, I am no longer your sister, Olivia. I am Queen Olivia! By the time I am done, the world will be full of toads. The origami soldiers will fold the inhabitants of the world into toads, and then I'll turn them into toads too. A kingdom of equal, unoriginal, indiscernible characters. The birth of a new toad kingdom. Hey Mario, look at this drawing. It's my face! It's done very nicely. You made the right choice by joining me, Mario. We'll rule this world! All that matters is that we stop my sister and all of the toads. Onward! Oh, hello. Olivia! Have you missed me, dear brother? Oh! There are many toads that we've seen in this world, and our journey has just started! Don't you think there are already enough toads? Ah, brother, remember how you would love origami, and you wanted an origami world? How can you not see the brilliance of a world of toads? A world for toads? 
A world where toads are turned into scrap paper sounds like a good world. You'll never turn my friends and I into toads. A purple sheet of paper is a deeper character than a toad. Very well. I thought perhaps you would listen to reason. I see I was mistaken. Ever since you teamed up with this Mario fellow, you've been nothing but a crinkle in my neck. It ends now. Consider this path closed. Alas, there will be an empty toad throne beside mine. But no matter, the birth of my toad kingdom is imminent. You may as well sit back and wait for its arrival. Ah! This stupid boulder won't budge! There has to be something we can do to save Ollie. Ollie? Ollie? Are you okay under there? Stop the toads! Forget about me! He's right! It was nice knowing you, Ollie! We've gotta go stop those toads! Oh wait! I just explode! Bob bombs explode! It's what we do! Let's get rid of this rock! Wow! Thanks for saving me, Mario and Bobby! It sure is convenient to have a permanent partner that can explode rocks and cracked walls. Let's go stop some toads! You know what, Professor Toad? You're not bad, especially for a toad. Not all toads are bad, but we still need to stop Olivia. Well, you're finally here. Took you long enough. As a matter of fact, it took you so long that there's nothing you can do to stop me now. Sister, are you still planning more terrible things? Yeah, who do you think you are? Sure, some toads in the world is fine. Even a town full of toads is okay. But a whole world of toads that you can't tell apart? Toads on every corner? Give me a break! The more toads, the better. I'm almost ready to turn the princess into a toad as well. I told you, didn't I, that I would transform all of the world into toads, including the princess herself. When you see a toad, you won't know if you're looking at a hero, or a nobody, or a princess. The world is better this way. You monster! Not only are you creating more toads, but you're turning unique characters into toads! You couldn't possibly do anything worse. You've taken things too far. Oh wow, I just noticed the cool decorations, by the way. I really like the cranes. Ah, thanks. I had some spare time being in quarantine, so I thought I should pick up some hobbies. Origami has been really fun. The biggest downside is you need square pieces of paper, but normal paper is 8.5 by 11, so I have to fold it into a square, and that's hard. That's pretty cool of you. I've folded a few cranes before, but I can't do it from memory. I need a guide in front of me to be able to fold a crane. We're getting carried away here. Sure, you have a visually stunning room, but there are too many toads in the world. That's the problem. I don't think there's such a thing as too many toads. You know what I do when people tell me there are too many toads? I want to make more toads! The paper world where Mario is a hero needs more toads. Mario should be a toad. You want Mario to be a toad? There's got to be some way that we can reason with you. There's no way that Mario can be a toad. He's Mario! A world of toads, paper toads, Mario toads, 
but every toad looks the same. That is my vision for a glorious toad kingdom. I'd like to thank Bowser for complimenting my room and the decorations I have here. But there's nothing you can do now to change my mind. Nice try, Dale Carnegie, but you can't influence me. After I defeat you, I'll honor your paper by folding you into a normal toad! I'm sorry, sister. I had no choice. Oh, but your poor body is all crumpled now. Maybe I went too far. No, Ollie. I realize what a silly mistake I made. A world where everyone is the same toad? And we can't tell them apart? Man, that's the cringiest thing I've ever heard. That's going to keep me up at night when I can't sleep. Wait, are you serious? Yeah, wanting to make the world all toads is omega cringe. It's fine to have some toads, but I went a bit overboard. Let me share my last words with you. This sums up my entire existence and all of the human experience. You're not human, you're origami, but I get your point. Let me hear it anyways. This too shall pass. Wow. That's pretty deep, Olivia. Yeah, everything is always changing. Your beliefs, the world around you, and even the people around you. We like to think of people as static, unchanging, but everything is always changing. This too shall pass. It's a realization that's both a blessing and a curse. In hard times, you can find solace in knowing that it will pass. But it also reminds you that good things pass by too. Sorry if I'm being a bit dramatic, but you kind of just killed me. At least, I don't believe that silly thing about wanting the world to be all toads anymore. Anyway, I hope you remember those words. I hope they comfort you in hard times and help you appreciate the good times. This too shall pass. This too shall pass! If you enjoyed this, there are a lot of other videos like this on my channel, and you're welcome to go check them out. Thank you so much for watching this video to the end, really appreciate you guys that watched this far into the video, and especially for this video, I hope that you got some value out of watching this one to the end. So thank you so much for watching, wishing all of you a great day, and take care everybody.